Guardian of Light was conceived uh, through the search of poetry, poetry between darkness and light within one object, within a light. The unusual thing is that you actually can touch a lampshade. In the first glance, um, it looks like a classic lampshade. And only when you pull this little corner, the light will gently appear. So the light turns on or off by an electromagnetic circuit. On the outside edge of the lampshade, there's some magnets folded inside. On the inside, hidden inside the construction, there is a contact, not visible. That contact realizes when the magnetic field comes close to the lampshade and then it opens or closes the electric circuit depending whether the light is being turned on or off. So that is the on-off switch and there is no other button uh, to turn the light on. So this is one of the first mock-up models. The first initial idea was to literally have the bent corner uh, at the top edge of the lamp, but that proved very unfunctional because especially in the tall version of the Guardian of Light it would be otherwise impossible to reach and open or close the lamp. The light is produced by Paluco and it was showed the first time at Cologne Furniture Fair in January in 2006. The light was originally designed in black, but also exists in white and a silvery grey. And uh, the lamp shade, the whole structure as well as the shade, is covered with a soft touch lacquer. So that feels a little bit like the petals of roses, I would say, like a cold and velvety touch. The act of actually opening and closing the lamp shade yeah, like a code or in the small version, like opening the page of a book. It's an experience that uh, most or every human being, regardless of nationality or gender, can, can intuitively feel. And for me, such a strong emotional bond to a product is one way of looking at sustainability nowadays. So the name Guardian of Light describes the poetic content of this lamp. The light is preciously hidden inside and kept inside until yeah, you decide to open it up and reveal the light.